My name is Reed Graves and I'm a urologist at St. Pete Urology. Prostate cancer is the most common non-skin related malignancy in men. And in the United States, the incidence, meaning how many patients come with prostate cancer a year is almost 233,000 in the year of 2014 are the estimates. So it's very common and affects a lot of people in our country and almost 30,000 people die of prostate cancer every year. So most anyone has someone that they've been touched uh, by that had some association with prostate cancer. So one of the things we do here at St. Peter Urology is we have a large focus on caring for patients with prostate cancer and the treatment of prostate cancer. Uh, the prostate is a gland that sits between the bladder and the urethra, which is in the penis, and this gland can sometimes uh, have become malignant. Uh, the way we discover that the gland becomes malignant is because we do blood tests on patients and screen them for prostate cancer with a test called the PSA, or prostate specific antigen. This test is elevated in them with prostate cancer because it becomes released from the prostate in times when the architecture of the tissue changes in circumstances such as a malignancy. The problem is that sometimes this architecture gets uh, changed and the PSA is elevated because of inflammation or infection or other non-malignant reasons. This is why we often do biopsies on men to determine if they indeed do have prostate cancer.